That's Political Corner. I'm joined by Jack Brill, the vice chair of the Sarasota County Republican Party. We're getting close to the midterm. I know you have some numbers, but a lot of candidates have come through here. Are you expecting a few more? Uh, I expect we're going to have the statewide candidates come visit the area one more time, and probably uh, if Governor Scott's back on the trail with, you know, he's been spending the time taking care of the hurricane bit right. up in, uh, for Michael up in the Panhandle. So there'll be, a, I'm sure we're going to have one more round. Obviously, President Trump's coming to Fort Myers on the 31st to uh, at Hertz Arena to uh, support Governor DeSantis' candidacy. How do you, you've, you've crunched a few numbers, uh, Vern Buchanan, Greg Stubbe, James Buchanan, Ray Pilon, Tommy Gregory, those names, are they looking pretty good based on Everything, turnout? I am absolutely excited about the turnout. There are 93,000 absentee ballots that have been sent out so far. far. 50,000 have been returned. And normally, in, in a normal election, the Democrats usually have a little bit of a lead in the absentees. We catch up in the early and then we win on election day. We're ahead on by almost 350 uh, ballots on absentee ballots as of yesterday. We're actually up 3,500 in early voting so far. We actually are winning and to getting more voters out at every early voting location except for the North uh, Library. All right, and Jack, so when we hear about this blue wave, the other side's pretty motivated. Here on the Sun Coast, it's much more difficult because there is a built-in advantage with registered Republican voters. There is, and I also think that uh, with everything that's gone on this fall, our base has really gotten excited. They're concerned about uh, the issues. There are a lot of amendments, you know, and there's some very important amendments both in the state and also also on the county, there's one in you know the city who have decide the date. There's one in Northport with their entire charter. There is a lot of important issues. We'll have our victory party at the Hyatt. Chairman Gruders, myself, our whole team, all the volunteers will have a great turnout like we usually do. We're looking forward to a great victory for all of our candidates, and it's going to be a lot of fun. Jack, thank you so much for joining us. Great, glad to be here as always.